down there in the southwest, the Four Corners area, Four Corners area, um, though a lot of it may be desert, there's a lot of beautiful desert out there. Um, I've, I've definitely spent several uh, preparation days um, hiking, which is a lot of fun as well. Um, there was one unfortunate uh, P-Day when as a zone, you know, a lot of us missionaries are getting together to visit Mesa Verde, which is up in Colorado near Durango. And so I was in that zone. I was in Pagosa Springs at the time, which is near Durango. So really excited to go to Mesa Verde, but it was, uh, I never got to see it because um, it was too snowy. There's, uh, the roads are too slippery. And so because it was too dangerous to go further, we um, made other plans instead, uh, played uh, like often, like often basketball is involved on P days as well. So, um, so like that. Um, I personally preferred um, the hiking moments as well. Um, especially, I guess, especially in like the Pagosa Springs, Colorado area, there are lots of, you know, the, just the, that valley area is just like beautiful, magnificent. Um, there's a place called Chimney Rock near Pagosa Springs, Colorado. Um, so there's a hiking trail up there and, uh, that was a lot of fun and me and my companion going up there and then running down the trail. Um, uh, even out in the reservation too, uh, every so often I've come across like kind of historical sites kind of thing, um, the, where you'd see these, um, like actually like old ruins of these, of these buildings. What is it like the... I can't remember if it was Pueblos. Uh, unfortunately, I forgot the name of the people of uh, the ancient civilization that was in the area. Um, but yeah, just these buildings that were built of a lot of flat rocks on top of each other. So kind of exploring those was, was really cool. A lot of fun. And uh, I do remember uh, when I was at Flagstaff, I don't think Flagstaff's in the mission anymore right now, but um, uh, there, was a, there was a trail like down underground called the lava tubes so it's just kind of these tunnels that were created by lava uh, lava channels like thousands of years ago so there's definitely a lot of hiking opportunities as well um, also Holbrook Arizona there's a petrified forest as well um, Holbrook uh, that area is well uh, very well known for petrified forest uh, petrified wood um, and uh, um, I guess also near Holbrook, Arizona is Winslow, Arizona. Um, there's a, there's a song, well, a country song, standing in a corner in Winslow, Arizona, or something like that, taking it easy, something like that. I think it's sung by the Eagles, and it's a statue of the lead singer standing on a corner in Winslow, Arizona. So, little, funny little monument there. Um, just in general, throughout the whole area, there are so many, you know, um, like gift shops as well. Those are, that's a popular place to go on P days. Um, just kind of almost any, any city you would go to, there'd be shops that would be full of, you know, like Navajo rugs and, and baskets and, and turquoise jewelry and uh, little Kachina dolls, little wooden uh, dolls made by the Hopis, just kind of these little figurines of, of warriors and, and other um, kind of legendary uh, figures. Um, so I know, um, I was all, always fascinated looking at all the, you know, the rings, the bracelets, and the watches, and just kind of the, the oh, and the pottery as well. Just all, all this fine craftsman, craftsmanship of, of the people down there in the area. Um, uh, it, was fast, it was just, you know, fascinating um, to me. So um, I would definitely um, recommend spending, you know, uh, preparation days, you know, looking at those gift shops and just kind of uh, checking them out and just admiring the craftsmanship. You know, buying some if you want to. You know, I didn't really buy much. Um, I just, I was, I was just happy to look at them. And uh, um, I do remember, yeah, uh, bolo ties, uh, kind of the ties with like, like, a, like a rock or a stone or a silver kind of thing with just a couple of strings. I, I never really noticed that those existed until um, my mission. So just seeing a lot of those in, in gift in uh, gift shops and seeing a lot of people wear them too. So, um, so yeah, lots of really fascinating things about just like the, the culture in the area.